Common Mistakes in English, Lesson 2. Students can easily confuse the simple present with the present progressive. I've seen this quite often with the verb think. I think or I am thinking. What's the difference? One difference is the kind of thinking. If you want to talk about your opinion, use I think. That's the simple present. For example, I think this is a funny movie. I think this is a very good magazine. I think it's very difficult to write in Japanese. When you use think to talk about opinion, you can simply say I think or I think that. But if you're talking about the process of thinking, and think means something close to decide, consider, reflect, then you need to use the present progressive, I am thinking. For example, I might say, we're thinking of taking a trip to Canada. We haven't decided yet, but we're thinking about it. So we're considering the idea of taking a trip, the process of thinking about it. Here's another example with a calculator. Shh, I'm thinking. So I'm telling you to be quiet because I don't want you to interrupt the process of my thinking. Get it? Example, roommate one, why are you sitting here in the dark? Are you trying to sleep? Roommate two, no, I'm thinking about work. There have been so many changes lately. I'm not sure I like them. Maybe it's time to find a new job. In this exchange, I'm thinking means I'm reflecting on all the changes at work. So in those examples, the difference was the kind of thinking. Again, opinion requires I think, the simple present. The process of thinking requires the present progressive, I am thinking. Another difference is time. If you're talking about all the time, in general, use the simple present, I think. For example, let's say I'm writing to my friend and I write, hello Tracy. I just wanted to let you know that I think of you often. I'm sorry I haven't written for a while. I think of you often, so I think about her a lot. Thoughts of her are in my mind all the time, or in general. But consider this example. My friend is in the hospital. I pick up the phone and I say, Hi, how are you? I'm thinking of you. I want to let my friend know that right now, today, thoughts of her are in my mind. Okay, let's review those differences. We use the simple present, I think, to express opinion or to talk about our thoughts in the general present. We use the present progressive, I am thinking, to describe how we consider or reflect on something or to talk about our thoughts at the time of speaking, meaning right now. 
Here's a final note on grammar. Do we say, I think that, I think of, or I think about? Let's talk about those differences. Use that to introduce a clause, which is a whole idea with both a subject and a verb. Example, I think that it's difficult to write in Japanese. The clause in this statement is, it's difficult to write in Japanese. Use of or about to introduce a noun, pronoun, or noun phrase. Examples. Do you often think about Henry? Are you thinking of him right now? Kathy still thinks of her old boyfriend Henry. How do you know when to choose about or of? You can think about or think of something, and there's usually no difference. For example, what do you think about the new boss? What do you think of the new boss? Both questions mean, tell me your opinion of the new boss. But consider these examples. Can you think of someone who can help? I need to think about all the possibilities before I make a decision. In these two examples, you must use the given preposition. Be careful. Infinitives and imperatives will not use the progressive. For example, we say, think about it. Please let me think. I want to think about it. I need you to think of a solution. Let's try an exercise. In this exercise, read each dialogue, then choose the correct verb to complete the statement. For example, read this dialogue to yourself, and then I'll tell you the answer. Wendy. Have you seen all the James Bond films? Jake. I have, and I think that Sean Connery made the best James Bond. Number one. Coworker 1. How are the kids? Coworker 2. Good, thanks. You know, I often think that parenting is harder than any office job. 2. Salesperson. Have you decided? Customer. I'm not sure. Salesperson. I think the coat looks great on you. And it's on sale today. 3. Roommate 1. Let's turn on the TV. Roommate 2. Shh. Not now. I'm thinking. I need quiet to finish this math problem. 4. Student 1. How did you like class today? Student 2. Our teacher explained things well, but I think that German grammar is difficult in general. 5. Husband. Why are you crying? Wife. I know it's silly. But I'm thinking of getting old, and I feel sad that all good things have to end. Husband. Don't think of such sad things. 6. Magician. Think of a number between 1 and 100. Child. Okay. Magician. Are you thinking of 43? Child. No, 71. I guess you can't really do magic. 7. Son. Dad, what are you thinking? You have the funniest expression on your face right now. Father. Do I? I just realized that I look and sound exactly like my own father when he was my age. 8.
Businessman 1. Do you want to make a deal? Businessman 2. Let me think about it. 9. Eve. Do you really want to break up with me? Brian. I care for you, Eve, but I need time to think. 10. David. Is your family really going to move to California? Claire. Maybe. My parents are thinking about it because my father got a very good job offer in Los Angeles. Okay, thanks for watching. Happy studies.